Hey guys, it's L2 What I Do because I'm back with another video. And today it's my birthday. I am so happy. Like I basically just finished all my maintenance as you can see. Got my lashes done, my nails done, and now my hair done. And I dyed it red because I just was I just was going through it. Like trying to have a new year, new me. And I've always said I wanted to dye my hair red and everyone's like, why don't you just dye it? I'm like, I'm because I'm scared. I was scared. But today I said, today's the day, like, I'm dyeing my hair. Oh my god, my face is red. Oh, I look a mess. Like, I look a mess. And I got red on these pants, which I was just like, I'm not even going to address as I'm leaving the store because I don't know why I decided to wear all white to a hair appointment. I think I was thinking in my head I'm getting my hair braided or something like I it didn't register that I shouldn't wear white so the fact that I got it on my pants like I can't even be mad because she was like take off your sweater because it literally is gonna get ruined but shout out to my girl Ari Ari do my, I think it's Ari does my hair Ari do my hair I forgot which one but my girl Ari knows what she's doing like she did it we had to tone it because i thought it was just too red and we went a little darker and this is exactly the vibe that i wanted without knowing without knowing this is the vibe that i wanted like i originally wanted it darker like more brown but i just think like that's me being scared like i knew that i wanted my hair red and i just wanted to full sun so this is it like and i know my hair is curly red that's gonna hit different i'm gonna try and keep this until all of summer and then I might go darker because she said that basically um, going red and then going back to like your original color like black is fine but if I wanted to go blonde again it's probably gonna take a couple sessions before I could get the blonde back in over the red so I honestly think in the summer I might go brown if anything but I don't know I just feel like this is so fun like I'm finally having fun like I am 24 years old guys that is so grown but Anyways, we're about to turn up with my friends. I have a rezzo tonight, so I'm really going home to take a nap and then get ready starting at six. I have to basically shower, get rid of this, and then do my hair. Maybe I shouldn't take a nap. Like, I should know myself. I can't even take a nap. I can't even take a nap. I'm just go head home, take a shower, do my hair because I have to curl this, and then get ready. I'm so excited. I'm 24. Hey guys, so I forgot to update you. I'm getting ready now. As you can see, I'm probably, you already know, I'm running late. Um, it's 6.50. Supposed to leave my house at 7. But look at my hair. It's so cute. Like, look. This is me, 24. See, I'm just going to finish my face quickly. You know how it Street, the heart of Toronto. Hey guys, so I'm back from my B day dinner. Look at my hair. The roots are looking very strong here, but from afar, it's not that strong. Um, so last night was very eventful. Went to Mademoiselle, which was so cute, and honestly, a great place for a birthday. Like, everyone had so much fun, and I had a ball like i knew it was gonna be a good time but they provided a great time like it was just so cute setting was cute food was good i got like this big dessert bowl which was like 
a great surprise like my friends know I love surprises so when they got that for me I was like I feel the love so heavily right now that was the night honestly came back home I didn't even get to eat my ice cream cake which is like my yearly tradition so I'm gonna eat that tonight but now I have to get ready because I have dinner with my dad um at 6 30 at this taps warehouse place I've never been but I've seen it on tiktok so I'll show you guys what I get and how it is but yeah I have to go get ready for that too I just booked an appointment with my eyebrow lady I just got my lashes done so I probably should have done that before getting my lashes done but it's okay we move um yeah so I just booked an appointment with her so I'm gonna go shower and then head over there and then get dressed for dinner because it's L2's B-Day weekend so I didn't have my mic on that whole time but hopefully the audio isn't that bad sorry just added it now we'll see what happens but i got these for christmas from my fam honestly i wanted these shoes for so long and i finally got them and i've just been so nervous to wear them but oh i was gonna show you the outside of my house i'm not doing that but it's literally dry outside today so thank you i'm thinking it's time to bust these bad boys out like oh my god this like I, don't, I know if you call it colorway i guess it is but this like metallic mcqueen for so long like so long i've been talking about it for years so so yeah i'm gonna go spray it now because i gotta protect the whites um and then let it sit and style them for my outfit tonight so excited i had to show you guys the fit so my pants are from zara shirt i don't know it's just a turtleneck coat from Topshop, purse from Coach. My dad actually got me this purse. That's the only reason why I'm wearing it tonight because he thought it was so cute. I don't really like Coach, but it does something with the fit. And then we got the McQueenies. They're still wet because I sprayed them. So hopefully that doesn't disrupt anything with my pants sagging on them, but this is the fit, guys. Time to go to dinner. We both still young, so what's the rush? The night is on you, we're not drunk enough. You'll come around if I don't do too much. We had our thongs, but we had way more us. Yeah. Hey guys, so I'm just gonna close up the vlog here because I forgot that I was vlogging my weekend. But guys i'm 24 years old this is so crazy like thanks to everyone that wished me a happy birthday love ya but everyone keeps asking like do i feel different yes because now i just feel like 24 is grown like that age is getting up there but also like me dyeing my hair like me being red is just so di like i feel so different I'm like i just act different like i have to act different now and this month has already been so crazy. I already know the rest of the year is going to be probably peak. Probably my best yet. I really hope so. And I think so. But yeah, um, I didn't really vlog much after I think I got my eyebrows done. Like dinner. Oh, oh. Dinner, I actually forgot to vlog. And then today I just went back out with my dad and I got my Apple Watch. I'm so late to the game, guys. Like, I'm so late to the game. But... I really never wanted an Apple Watch. Um, I just feel like it ruins your outfit. Like, I don't know if that's just me, but personally, Apple Watch just ruin your outfit. So I never wanted one. But now that I'm grown, I'm on my fitness journey. So I really need to have my Apple Watch to know which workouts are working for me and which aren't, or like which ones get my heart rate going. And I really have to bring my phone, my water bottle, my bands to the gym. And it's just doing a lot like i really need to have an apple watch by now so we got that done but yeah that was my birthday like honestly had so much fun at mademoiselle if you ever want to host a birthday dinner 10 out of 10 recommend mademoiselle like my experience was so good everyone was so nice just the way they treat you on your birthday is honestly so good like you get complimentary coat check they like let you wait at the bar until your table's ready then the dessert that my friends got me was so cute like i literally was like i feel so loved and yeah the vibe was just so good like people were just dancing taking their pics like taking pics unjudged like we love that for the girlies 
and honestly this year is all about the girlies so stay tuned for new segments that i have coming up guys i'm gonna try to do more reviews like hopefully at least one a month and then i have a new segment coming where i just drop the tea for the girlies so stay tuned for that but you guys on the drill don't forget to like comment and subscribe and i'll see you in the next one Living without you, it's me, man. On a cloud with you.